Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I have not done a Friday favorites in forever, and I did. Why is my nose super? Sh oh, it's the shadow from the lights. Um, I haven't done a Friday favorites in quite a while, so I decided that I would go ahead and film one for you guys, just because. Whew, my what do you call it my monthly favorites have been pretty long not that I think that that's a bad thing but I have a lot of things that I have been loving lately um, a good chunk of lip products and stuff normally this time of year spring and summer I'm not huge on makeup so that's why you guys have only been seeing posts like once a week um, because I do my makeup tutorials once a week otherwise I'm like down for some mascara and lippies like lippies is holy grail during this time of the year as well as lashes if I can put some on which you guys have been noticing that I've been rocking them out a lot lately but yeah um, so let's go ahead and get started I'm gonna start off with skincare products I've been using my normal skincare um, products like my coconut oil and stuff like that in fact I've been asked several times to do an updated skincare like product routine um, I actually filmed a get on ready with me where I take off my makeup but it switches up a lot um, the products stay the same but I kind of depending on what I'm doing I switch it up a little bit but I've been testing out these two products this one I just recently did a review on it is the clarity organic vitamin C serum with E plus hyaluronic acid and this is from Ooh natural I did a review on this on my blog I can definitely do a review here on YouTube if you'd like me to do it but basically it is a vitamin C serum you put them on put it on every morning about five drops it helps to illuminate and just brighten up your face um, because the vitamin C has natural brightening capabilities um, but it also helps to decrease wrinkles and stuff so you know I have been using some new things and I have been on a serum kick lately so things like this and the next product I'm about to talk to you about I have really consistently added it to my make um my skincare routine so I've been asked a lot um, you know what have I been doing different with my skin so I think I might actually do that video after this and show you the products that I've been using but anyway ugh, okay so this I have been loving um, I have another vitamin C serum coming in that I need to test out which is perfect because this bottle is gonna be empty soon and I'll have another one yay the next product is from Perlier or Perlier um, I've actually reviewed their volcanic scrub which I think is perfect for like the feet but I couldn't like use it on my face but I have been loving this this is their royal elixir it's a face youth serum that has fresh royal jelly now royal jelly comes directly from the queen bees so this is definitely awesome and basically what you do is you apply it day and night um, I apply it before my moisturizer but after my cleanser I go ahead and put it on it feels so good it's got like micro pearls and everything it feels so good my skin's been staying hydrated and moisturized and looking awesome so I am loving this product here I will be doing a formal review on this I've only been using it for about two and a half weeks now and I'm already like holy grail okay um, next is a nail polish I painted my nails um, at the beginning of the week and I am using the Maybelline color show nail polish in the color pretty in peach and that's what it looks like here and that's what is on my nails right now the flowers are from my Seat or Chiat um, nail kit but that's what it looks like and I am absolutely loving this shade Whew, okay let's talk since I've been talking about glowy illuminating skin I am just when it comes to spring and summer months I love glowy illuminated skin I loved that glow from within I love to look bronzy um, I don't rarely use foundation or face products so for me I really have to not only use the illuminating 
highlighters and bronzers but I really have to care for my skin so I took care of that by showing you guys the skincare I've been loving but when it comes to bronzers and stuff like that the ones that I've been using a lot the last two weeks um, if I want to use it is Goddess by Wet n Wild and this bronzer is matte it's a deep bronzer which is perfect for me I've been enjoying that a lot I've also been rotating to this Sun to Sun bronzing powder and this is in bronze mist and that's what I used to create my <clears throat> bronze contour today and I also used the highlighter area too um, <clears throat> excuse me for highlighters I have been loving these two this is the Milani Illuminating Face Powder, and I actually did use it in this look. I don't know if you guys can see, but it is super glowy right here on my cheeks, on my forehead. Probably why my nose is really reflecting my lights on me. This has always been a favorite for me. I received this last year from Milani, I believe, and it is... It's got like peachy tones in here, but let me just tell you that this is the perfect... Um, Illuminizer. If you're looking for a great highlighter that is drugstore, this is like seven bucks or something like that. I swirl my brush all in it and it's like a brown gold, but it's so soft, like all you see is the illuminating part because of that peach. I don't even know if you guys are picking it up, but because of that peach and soft tones, when it all gets blended together with the brown, I just kiss my face with it with the brush and it just offers a nice highlight love it and I filmed a review for this I'm going to have swatches and stuff like that on my blog once the review is up here on YouTube but this is awesome this NYX sun-kissed radiant finishing powder that's what it looks like here um, I've obviously used it a lot so the colors are just blending together but I've been focusing more on the lighter shades here for highlight and it just offers such a sweet soft I don't need I don't know why I'm showing you guys again I'm not gonna see it but I am loving this and this is a new product that NYX just released for spring 2014 as well so stay tuned for the review on that for my blush this is kind of standard you guys will see it in a lot of my videos um, because again I love that bronzy illuminated glowy look because I can pull that off with a pair of lashes and some lip product and I'm good to go um, so the Milani face um, Milani powder blush this is in warm petals that's what I have on again today super wearable just a gorgeous gold shimmery blush and this came out last year so it's limited edition I'm sorry about that okay let's talk lippies because I have quite a bit I'm gonna start off with what is on my lips right now it is a gorgeous nude from Maybelline and this is the Maybelline color elixirs and this is in the color petal plush that's what it looks like here and this particular shade is a kind of shimmery pink I'm going to have it, it's a light shimmery like baby pink but wearable not baby like Nicki Minaj or Barbie pink it's super wearable and nice I'm going to be having a full review on these I just love the staying power I've had this on my lips now for three hours um, since I uh, reapplied it and staying power is really really nice on it I definitely want to get one or two more colors I also have been loving the vision in violet which is a gorgeous radiant orchid shade that's what it looks like here I actually you know what I want to try and blend these two together that's a soft shade that it comes out to that's pretty okay let me wipe my hand why do I never have my wipes available when 
I'm doing a video. Hello. But anyway, I'm really, really loving these. Um, the stain power on them is awesome for a gloss. They're a little bit more pricey than I would like, so I normally buy them when they're on sale. Um, the smell of it when you first open the tube smells almost chemically, but it disappears after you apply it to the lips. But I'm really liking these. I think they're great. Next is my one of my favorite favorite lippies for this time of the year and it is the Jordana twist and shine lippies um, I have three that I've been using quite a bit because they're perfect again like I said mascara or lashes lips done um, the first one is in the color tropical frenzy I'll go ahead and swatch that it's just a gorgeous pink the next one is sweet pink which is one of my favorites because it's super wearable like every day just a nice soft pink I don't know if the camera's picking it up the same but they definitely are different ones lighter than the other and then the other one is candied coral and this one I have been loving a lot I've been rocking out them corally orange shades so I've been using that coral shade a lot on my lips um, they have pretty good staying power they are seriously like a dollar something so well worth it get them in every color I own every single color some of the browns have that funky glitter to them but these pink coral shades are friggin awesome the red is awesome as well and last for lippies is my Laura Mercier lip glaze in tulip I believe I used this in a tutorial I am just in love with this shade like seriously it is awesome sauce feels great on the lips it is just a perfect everyday shade do you guys see a trend here mm hmm but um, yeah so pinky nudie type shades and the Sun and the my light covering just came off um, I have really really been liking those soft pinks nudie type shades I think they are awesome they're great and easily wearable so yeah that is my favorites today on Friday it is 12 17 or I mean 12 minutes going tick tock tick tock so I am going to sign off here I hope you guys enjoyed my favorites don't forget guys if you haven't already go ahead and check out my blog down below um, and definitely please leave me any comments for ideas, thoughts, any type of videos or anything you guys want to see. I did film a makeup tutorial for this simple everyday kind of mommy makeup type look. Um, you could totally drop it down minus the winged liner, but hey, you know, I need my little wing liner. Um, and yeah, I hope you guys are doing well. I wish you all an awesome and wonderful weekend and I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye.